Hi there, and thanks so much for tuning in to AccessAlert.tv. Uh, today I'm going to show you another updo that you can do at home yourself. Um, again, for the everyday or dress it up a little bit if you're going out. Um, for this look, I find it a little bit easier to start from curly. It just helps give the updo a little bit more texture and look a little bit dressier. Um, if you want to see how I got these specific curls, you can watch an earlier tutorial I did um, called How to Use Your Curling Wand. Um, or you can use your regular curling iron, or if you have naturally curly hair, you can also diffuse it with some mousse and just go with your natural curl. So today I'm going to do a side ponytail. It's not going to be like a tight ponytail with an elastic. It's more going to be swept over. I'm going to do a little bit of a French twist in the back. If you, again, if you want to watch an earlier tutorial called How to Do a French Twist. But this is just going to be a really quick look. It's only going to require about five, maybe six or seven bobby pins, but not many. And all you need is bobby pins and maybe a bit of hairspray. Um, so I'm going to show you what I'm doing in the back and then we'll come over, back over to the front and show you how to finish it off. Okay, so I'm going to start by taking hair from over on my right side. And I'm actually just going to start twisting it. and pinning into the twist. I find it easier to open the bobby pin, grab a section, and push right into that twist. So once you have your twist in the back, you're gonna come back over to the front. And really quick, the reasoning why I often choose um, my left side when I'm doing updos that show from the side is I would say it, it generally works better to go with your natural part. So I part my bangs over to the left. So you're gonna to wanna to just keep with the natural look and bring the updo over to the side uh, where the heaviest part of your hair is. So to finish this off from the front, either you can just take a little piece back here and just secure that with a bobby pin. So you can just leave it like that, really simple. You can add a clip or a flower or something here. Um, another look you could do is look at the earlier tutorial of braiding your side bang. And you can do a bit of a French braid into that. But just leave this nice and loose and natural. Maybe put a bit of spray in it. Just go with the natural curl that you already have in it. And there you have it, just a really simple look you can use with minimal bobby pins, minimal product. Uh, just to change up the everyday. If you like what you see, you can like us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks so much.